Today I'm going home with Yano. I was packing my bags when he insisted that we go together. Besides, I might just suddenly freeze again like I did at lunch if I go by myself. I'm glad I'm going with Yano. Because if someone tries to kidnap me, I will show them Yano. And he will look so freaking cute and adorable that everyone is going to go away from me. He is the perfect weapon. After we got off the bus, we walked on the street, which was pretty empty. Master, I don't care how you are, but I don't care how you are. I don't care how you are. As said before, I will use you as my shield, and you will be the perfect defensive weapon. We got Master. I felt bad to see Yano be so gloomy. It's not his or any of the other boys' faults. Technically, on one hand, yes. On the other hand, it's your fault. On the third hand, it's the fault of the girls who think that any of this is their business. Freaking idiots. This is why I can't stand teenagers, actually. I hate being one myself. If they found out that the girls actually hit me in the alleyway, they'll blame themselves more. I had to be the one to comfort him. Well, things can happen. Not everything can work out. Don't worry about it. I gulped down the nervousness and acted tearful on purpose. But Yano didn't seem to feel any better. But Master is <laughs> Thank you for worrying about me. I'll be more careful now. Um, and... You remember that this is a secret from Tay Red and Yuri, right? Okay, thanks. Huh? I heard a ringtone and realized it was my phone. Which, for some reason, I, in the meantime, had changed from vibrate to actually sounding? Uh, wait. I asked Yano to understand and pressed the call button. Help! Hiroin! Hiroin! As soon as I put the phone on my ear, I heard Red screaming. What's going on? Uh, he's having another erotic dream and he's screaming your name out in joy? No. Does he know what happened to me this morning? Yeah? What's up? I tried my best to sound calm. But I couldn't help but gulp. What? Did Lance tell him? He told me he'd never tell. No, he said he'd never tell if possible. Oh, wait. He said, if possible. Eh, at least she remembers that. <laughs> I just gave up and waited for Red to finish. No, you're going to get Huh? Oh, right. Lance said he just registered my name. Red must have got excited and called. Hearing his reaction, I guess he doesn't know what happened to me this morning. Thank God. I wonder what Eri's last name is. Was it mentioned? I don't think so. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what do you mean I convinced him? I don't need his permission to join the club. Besides, I was the one that needed to convince him to be the heroine. I couldn't see him since we were talking on the phone, but I'm sure Red's jumping up and down right now. But... The more I hear his excited voice, the clearer I remembered what happened this morning. Why? I don't know why I suddenly remembered Red saying he'd come and rescue me. 
Uh, your brain was going on overdrive. It doesn't have to make sense. 아무튼 연습은 수업 끝나고 하는 거고 꼬박꼬박 나와야 해. 끝나고 나면 다 같이 집에 가거든. 그러고 보니 이젠 매일 같이 갈수 있겠네. 신난다. 란스 큰 녀석이 너 연습 빼먹게 하지 말라고 당부까지 하더라. 도대체 어떻게 설득한 거야? I ask again, why did I have to convince him of anything? <laughs> I now understand why Lance made me join the club. They all go home together after rehearsal? Everyone's living in the same direction? Now I won't have to go home by myself. He wouldn't have been keen about it, but he did it all for me. I felt touched. Let's talk more about the plane at home. I'm with Yano right now. Hmm, heroine. 아무튼 정말 잘 생각했어. 그럼 이따가 보자. Red hung up the phone. Yano was listening in on the conversation and widened his eyes and asked. That should be Yano, comma, who was listening in on the conversation, comma. Commas are very important, and they are your friends. They make a huge difference to what a sentence means. Uh, Master, 연극하는 거 수락한 거예요? 레드의 목소리가 여기까지 들렸어요. Uh, yeah, it just happened. 그렇군요. 잘 됐어요. 부활동을 하면서 빨리 이 일을 잇는 게 좋겠어요, 마스터. Yeah, you're right. I really hope it does. Yano finally loosened his face and smiled a bit. Today's dinner is... Tomato spaghetti. Oh, that sounds awesome. Wait, you mean spaghetti with tomatoes? Or spaghetti made out of tomatoes? I'd be interested in trying either. Yana's dishes are always decorated so well. It was cute the way the small mozzarella pieces were sprinkled on the spaghetti. I felt like he cared about every single tiny shred of cheese. It, is the mozzarella in pieces like cubes, or has it been shredded? I don't think a mozzarella would shred that well. What's <laughs> 오늘은 일찍 와서 저녁은 내가 만들어도 되는데. 마스터 힘내시라고요. <웃음> I'm having a bad period day, so I'm being very down. So you're not cooked for me. Let's use that as excuse, okay? Okay. As I requested, Yana didn't tell anyone what happened today. Yellow, 좋은 생각이야. 히로인은 내일부터 연극 연습을 해야 하니까 힘을 내야 하거든. 연극? 결국 하기로 한 거야? <웃음> 어떻게 란스 저 녀석을 설득한 건지는 모르겠지만 아무튼 히로인이 연극부에 입부하게 됐어. 난저 녀석이 직접 와서 히로인 이름을 써 놓을 줄은 몰랐다니까. 어. I highly doubt that. Yuli whistled. But Lance just scoffed, it, scoffed as if that would never happen. And he laid down the spoon for a while. Hmm? What? Yuri looked at Lance as if he had just said something absurd. He seemed to ask Lance what the hell he was saying. And Tay and Red made the same face. Uh, as Yon stepped up to Yuri's expression became odd. What's the reason? What happened? I hope they don't figure it out. 
Lansnian looked at me. It's as if they're asking me permission to tell them. While us three were silently communicating with her eyes, Yul looked appalled. Why is my honey and my side being attacked? My honey got hit by the limousine. No one is going to take my limousine. Why is Hiroin not going to be in the limousine? That, that's. 그녀를 질투하는 시선이 많기 때문입니다. Lance made it clear. You relaxed after hearing that. 뭐야 그런 이유였어? 질투는 우월한 이들이 숙명적으로 그리고 습관적으로 무시해야 할 미덕이 아닌가? Yeah, but if I ignore them, they beat me over the head with it. They demand attention. 하지만. 그게 정도가 심하면 무시할 수 없게 되잖아요. The boys will surely get suspicious now. 심해지다니. 갑자기 왜 그런 말을 하는 거야? Oh, this isn't good. Tay started interrogating us. I think he already sensed that something happened. 무슨 일이 있었던 거지? 자초지종을 말해봐. 아, 그, 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 그게... 말해도 되겠습니까? I really hoped it wouldn't go this way. Tae, Yuri, and Red all focused on me. Since this already happened, it's just best for me to explain. I let out a sigh and opened my mouth. Um, well, actually, something happened. 그녀가 유리의 리무진을 타고 다니는 바람에 질투에 찬 여학생들이 오늘 아침에 그녀를 납치했습니다. God damn it, Lance! I was gonna tell them. I didn't give you permission to tell them. I wanted to do it. Jeez. 납치? Everyone stared at me. Red even dropped a spoon. Ah, Hiroin, you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? First, Red, let's hear the story more. Then, the other boys were looking for her. The 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 boys were looking for her. Thank you so much for making me not do anything, Lance. I am so grateful that the big man is making sure that the little woman is not doing anything evil. I, I was kidnapped, but nothing serious happened, and I lied a bit to not make a big deal. But seeing everyone's expressions, it seemed useless. Everyone seemed to be in panic already. This is why I didn't want to say it. My honey, 정말 괜찮은 거야? 일단 외상은 없는 것 같은데. 마스터는 지금은 괜찮대요. 하지만 앞으로는 누군가가 꼭 등교와 학교를 함께 해주었으면 해요. 그래서 연극부에 그녀의 이름을 넣은 겁니다. 상황이 이러하니 앞으로 그녀가 리무진을 타는 일은 없을 겁니다. Because you should always submit to whatever your bullies or blackmailers want you to do. Because that will always, always work out and no one like them immediately stop bullying you. You guys need a reality check. If it's true, I can't do it. My honey, I'm not going to be able to do it. Even Yuri was looking at me with worry, and Tay seemed to be lost in his thoughts. <sighs> I wish she would tell me who it was. I would so deliciously break them. Red abruptly stood up from his seat. Hiroin, Miyane. Red? Red didn't answer and just stormed out.
That sounded more like he was deliberately walking out and not storming out. Seemed very slow steps. Red? Lance stopped me from trying to follow him. Now be a good dog and sit back down. I said sit. I heard Red leave the house. You're going to school with me? Didn't you just hear? You are going to go to school with him, not him going to school with you. Get your priorities correct. Ugh. Between uh, potentially being bullied and kidnapped again and going to school with you, I think I'd go for the bullies. Ugh. It's not so bad to go to school with Lance, but it bothers me that I have to wake up early every morning. I'm bad at waking up in the morning as it is. But seeing Lance's expression, I could tell he's really determined. Lance finished what he had to say and went to his room after putting away his plate. The man has spoken. But still, I'm thankful that he cares about me. I guess I'll have to wake up early now. I already feel tired. That's because you had a traumatic event and you need time to recover. Now go to bed. <sighs> I stopped writing in my diary. I was still bothered by the fact that Red stormed out of the house. It's been a while since he left, but I haven't heard him come back inside. He might have gotten lost somewhere. Or he might be feeling depressed. Red's apology kept hovering around my ear. It must have been a shock for him that he didn't rescue me. He did always tell me to trust him. Besides, Red genuinely believes he's the warrior of justice. He is a warrior of justice, not the warrior. He would have been shocked and even felt guilty about what happened to me. Hmm? I was cleaning up my bag after writing in my diary when I found the chocolate cookie inside. Right, I was going to give this to Red. I felt more worried about him after seeing the cookie in my hand. Should I look around the house? I still feel scared of going out by myself, but as long as I don't go too far, I'll be okay. I quietly got ready to head out. Mm -hmm. I thought I might have to go for a bit to find Red, but the plan changed as soon as I stepped out. Red was crouched down right in front of the house. Red. I held onto the chocolate cookie and sat beside him. Ah, uh, Hiroin. Red's voice was completely spiritless. Yeah, don't worry about me. Red didn't continue and just looked up at the sky. It was unlike him to be this quiet. Well, since chocolate makes everything better, we're going to give him the chocolate cookie. I quietly watched the stars too and handed him the chocolate cookie. Huh? I brought it to give it to you. You know Banjul, the cafe Che works at? I got it from there. You seem to like chocolate. I hope Red feels a bit better with this. 
because chocolate is the universal problem solver. Red? Red didn't take the chocolate cookie I handed him. I don't think he feels any better. Does he not like the cookie? Beauty. Hmm? About what? I pretend to be clueless. Of course. I knew he'd say this. Red always sincerely believes that he's the hero. I knew one day he'd have to face reality and get sad like this. Why are you sorry? How could you have known that I was kidnapped? Of course, it would have been nice if you knew. I felt a bit embarrassed thinking that I actually thought of Red during that incident. It's realistically impossible. I never wanted to say this to Red. But if his reality and ideals are too far apart, he will only get more gloomy. Lance is not a hero. If anything, he's an anti-hero. Oh, yes. Lance really saved me from the girls. Actually, Soy and Shinbi are the heroes. They help me. He looked like he'd start crying any minute now. But he seemed to try his best to keep back his tears in front of me. I'm pretty sure if we make a mistake here we're gonna get a bad ending. But asking questions is always good. Why do you want to be a hero so badly? Red didn't say anything. I've never seen Red stay this quiet. I think his self-confidence has hit rock bottom. And I felt bad thinking it's because of me. I'm the one who feels sorry. I know how much he genuinely cares for me. I thought for a while on how I can comfort him. And for a moment, silence flowed between us again. I decided to be honest instead of saying anything fancy. The reason why Red is so awesome, the reason I'm always thankful towards him. You are an awesome aspiring hero. What? You're not a perfect hero yet, but you have the innocent heart it takes to become one. I know that you really care for me. That's why your spirits are so low right now, isn't it? You really are like Red from TV, the way you think of your team and treat others honestly. I hope my sincerity reaches you like yours always does. <laughs> Yes, of course. I gave him a biggest smile as the one he showed me before.
Is it cold right now? I'm sure it is cold, but... Uh, Eri, don't make me repeat again how stupid you are. Red? Your ears are red. Are you cold? I reached out my hands to cover his ears when he abruptly got up. I was surprised and faltered a bit because he got up so suddenly. But Red hesitated to see me like that as well. Huh? What's going on? Maja. 그래. 나는 영웅 지망생이야. 아직 진정한 힘에 눈을 뜨지 못한 것뿐이야. 아직은 말이야. 언젠가는 TV에 나오는 레드처럼 특별한 힘에 눈을 뜰 거야. 히로인, 그때가 되면 정말로 너를 너를 지켜줄 거야. 그러니까 앞으로도 열심히 노력할게, 히로인. Red seemed much brighter than before. I felt so much better to see him like that. But... Even if you don't have special powers, you are a great guy, Red. But I don't think it's yet time to say that. Choco cookie, it's really delicious! Thank you, I'll eat well. It's cold. Let's go in. Yeah. And... Hmm? Thank you. Thank you. At that moment, my heart jumped a bit. My ears felt hot. Oh, it must be cold. Right, Eri? I want to know more about why Red obsesses on being a hero so much. Red's great enough without being the hero. Does he not know that? Heroin. I've seen that in a long time. No. I don't know if I'm going to cry with other people. Then, the other girls are like me. The sunlight warmed up the room. Is it morning already? The weather must be good today, too. No one came to wake me up, but I got out of bed. Right. I decided to take the bus to school from today. And Lance is going with me. I hope Lance doesn't nag me. No, actually... Silence is more scary than his nagging. I headed to the living room, imagining going to school with Lance. I finished breakfast as usual and hurried out the front door to catch Lance. Lance, do you really have to go out so early every morning? 당신에게 거부권은 없습니다. 또 납치되고 싶은 건 아니겠죠? As I've said before, between you and the bullies, I'd pick the bullies. Ah, Prince. 그렇게 쌀쌀 맞게 굴 거면 차라리 나한테 맡기는 게 어때? Because you're the driver of the limo, unfortunately. 당신에게 맡겨서 이 지경이 된 겁니다. 제 수고는 생각하지 않는 겁니까? God, this all happened because of you. It all happened to her. But can you see how I am suffering from this? Selfish dick. Lance was so right, I couldn't say anything and just put on my shoes. My mind was so urgent, I couldn't put on my shoes properly. Red ran out of Grandpa's room and yelled. 
Huh? There wasn't time for Red to go out, but he seemed to be all ready. 내가 왜 히로인을 지키지 못했는지 깨달았어. 그런 건 나중에 일기에 쓰시든지 하세요. 바쁘니까 저희는 먼저 가도록 하죠. The boys keep diaries too. Why am I sounding a surprise? We've been collecting the diaries over the course of the let's play. Of course they do. When Lance was about to urge me, Red grabbed my arm. Red? I was surprised at the unexpected touch and looked at him. Lance seemed just as surprised and silently frowned. So I will now follow you all the time, including into the bathroom and the toilet. And he passed Lance to open the front door. Red dragged me out, still holding onto my wrist. What are you doing? Do you want to go with Heroine? I'm going to go with her. I'm sorry. I'm going to keep Heroine. I'm going to be my family. I've heard him say this often before, but it was a bit different today. He seemed more determined. As I hesitated, Red held on to me tighter and pulled. Yongungi tegi wian chokkorumul tenen goya. Hiroin. Tangshin ne maril mushi. Chokkorumun baro. Lance egeso toman chenen goya. Red? With those last words, Red ran off with my arm in his hand. W wait, aren't you running too fast? But, but Lance was just caring for me. At my wed words, Red turned around and looked at me. He was still running fast. So he's running backwards? His red hair flapped through the wind. For a moment, Red let go of me. While I was flustered, his palm touched mine. He locked his hand into mine and grinned. Red held onto my hand tighter. I felt his warmth spread to my hand. My heart started beating fast from what he said. I heard the wind swoosh as we hastened our footsteps. And amidst the sound, I could hear footsteps of two people running in the same rhythm. I could just tell by listening to the footsteps. Red is genuinely happy right now at this moment. He looks much better than the red from TV, the way he's smiling. I don't care if he doesn't become the hero. I don't care if he doesn't protect me. I like him just the way he is right now, so positive. This is when he looks best. My face heated up thinking that. Ah! Hmm? Choco cookie. Yeah. Buji mashasso.